be an example, but there are people who have honorary degrees, like uh, Bill Cosby, I think, has an honorary degree. You know what I'm saying? Like, people like that. Bill Cosby ain't no, he ain't no intellect like that. He's a comedian. Right, right. It, uh, to me, this is this is a joke still. This, this is a major joke. Trust me. But, but you know what's funny? You think they would ever give a person like uh, me an honorary um, OD? No, they might go say me, 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 me. Yeah, I actually think I actually think you would be able to get one of them Vegas. You, you're not a you're not a common them, bro. And you are. No, but you know what? You I have the upper momentum. I, don't talk yourself out of it. You I actually. No, 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 no. I'm talking myself out of it because it doesn't mean anything. Because it's it's not Brazil. Look at that. It looks nice friend, on the wall. It looks nice on the wall. You, get you know what? You know what look nice. You know what look nice on my wall. The, the plaque them that says I sold 200 records are, you know, no, have, I a, have a freaking diamond plaque to get from 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 um, Sokadana. That's gonna look something good. That you have life. a story. I get it. Something that you have a story to tell. Yeah. Honorary degree. You don't something have something that I worked for. Yeah, I get it. Bro. And, and, and anyone who wants to get it, they have to work for it. You see, not not to be out there hustling black people. Taking away black people tithe and offering, putting it into their account, keeping black people passive, having black people waiting for a man to come out the sky and be rewarded for it. It's a joke. Why would I want this? Well, what maybe want to want to can't get to get to get in a want to, you can't use that, but you would have to take out my heart and look for my heart still. And, and, and you know what else too? Now you could put doctor in front of your name. You could be like Dr. Clifford Smith. <laughs> That, that that would be because when people attack to me, they must talk to me good. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Even though your degree honorary. When Dylan Janem and, 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 and the idiot brother over 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 the Dagger Squad, I talk about Kemet or Egypt have anything to do with Christianity. Then we can't make them know so they talk it do they talking to a doctor. <laughs> All right, so he's we working on we working on that honorary degree for Subi. No, bro, I don't want an honorary degree. Bro. <laughs> Listen, after after you get your master's, we're gonna get the honorary for you. What you want to get it in? Sociology, psychology. No, no, after bro, I'm done. I'm done. Yeah, yeah, I want no honorary. You get those, when you get those honorary degrees and then you run for politics in Jamaica, all that's gonna look nice. I'm like Dr. Smith. Running for the head of PL, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna look if nice. I, if, I run, if I run for politics in Jamaica, Jamaica will not Jamaica. I will not get 20 votes. Trust me. I don't think so. I don't brother. Think you gotta be more politicians, optimistic, bro. Politicians, politicians, they have to lie. They have to sell a pipe dream. And and I can I'm too honest to go into politics. There you're right. Definitely, they go, definitely they go, got a lot to get your way. You got to manipulate bro, politician. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to sugarcoat information, and you know, see, Damon Crawford don't even bother do it anymore. Lisa and I is getting out because you don't these people don't see him in the media anymore like that. That's a fact. Huh? I say you don't even really see him in the media like that, like the international media. No, the man is raising. The man is raising goats, man. The, is that yeah. But. Yeah. To get back on topic, bro, I, th I think, I think th th this is like a big slap in the face of the ancestors who fought against religious factors. You see what I say? Reverend Justin Albert, field of religion and community service. Community service. Maybe Trust we should me. look up these names and see some of the projects that they've done. Let's let's. I don't care how much project them want put upon them. My point is this, right here. General Pope do a lot of community project. We can't deny that. But because what? Because he's not fooling black people that they're going to go to heaven and get milk and honey. So he can't take away them little money. Come on, brother. Bishop Enoch Sylvester, for 60 years, of this thing with service to religion. If you stayed in, in religion 60 years and fool black people, you should be ready to go to hell. You know, I just tried to look up the name of one of those people and I didn't find a black person, but I want to be sure before I throw it out there. So I'm gonna look it up some more. 
but it looked like they're not even black people. Wait, there. let me stop. Going. You have the pictures of the people or no? I think I lost it. Wait, wait, wait. wait. What the hell? I think I lost it. What did I do with it? It seems like I lost it. The gun. Anyway, what may I say, brother? I don't care if them black, white, pink, or blue. If they are Quakers or Freakers or Breakers. You see? There is no religious institution, members, reverend, bishop, whatever, should be getting an award on independence, quote unquote, independence day. What that is, what that is, that's what I'm saying. Give them, give them, give them one, create a different day for them. If you want to continue to have them um, preaching the gospel, but independence, anybody with any form of um, historical knowledge of slavery will understand how Christianity was weaponized and used against black people. That's how we may talk about, brother. I mean, this is how far you have come now until you can accept it. I don't care how far you have come now where we can sit in the church and without chains. The facts still remain that the slave masters sat up at had, had one of our brothers up there reading only certain parts of the Bible, telling them to obey Massa with fear and trembling, while Massa was the usher or the overseer. And that was the only place they allowed us to congregate so they could further colonize our minds, soul, soul and body. That was it. No, I got it, bro. I got day, it. We are still mentally challenged because of this um, 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 thing that they gave us. Post-traumatic slave disorder. Of course, to use that we, all are, we have ninety percent of our people are suffering from Stockholm syndrome. So, so to me, the order of distinction in Jamaica is a joke. It's a major joke. On Independence Day, brother, you're awarding religious people on Independence Day. Dude, they had George Stinney sitting on a Bible when they were crucifying him. And they yeah? did that in a lot of places. That was a normal thing. They had, they, they had Christian people with Bibles. Open Bible, they, reading they, Bibles they, before they executed black brothers and sisters. That's what I was saying. I felt like one of the kids that they sent to the electric chair, he was too short. So they put Bibles George up. Stinney, the George yeah, Stinney, George yeah you had to prop him up, right? To make exactly. him head, head high up enough to fit the thing. You're right. Thank you. Thank you, um, Gila. Or Jella. Six years of enslaving the mind of, 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 of further enslaving or colonizing the mind of your brothers and sisters, and you're 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 giving an award. You're giving one of the highest award on Independence Day. Yeah, but again, Vegas, plain devil's advocate, from their perspective, they don't see it like that. They're not Bro, gonna see it like that. Because they have that cognitive, the cognitive I dissonance. I don't care how they want to see it, bro. What I'm saying is. You are subscribing and you are you are a part of an organization that was used to colonize black people, to enslave black people. I don't care how you want to see it. I don't no, care. The thing is, they're going to tell you that that wasn't what God wanted. They took God's word and misconstrued his words to get what they wanted. That's what they're going to tell you, Vegas, and you know that. They're going to say that wasn't God's intentions. That was the man's intentions. And he it still doesn't matter. If it was not God's intention or whatever it was, it was still used as a weapon. So you who are a part no, of the biggest, a knife could be, a car could be used as a weapon. Does that make a car bad? No, it's the person that is driving it. Exactly. So the same thing they're going to say for religion. The religion but, is just a vehicle. If the, the person car, who's driving it. If the car is faulty. Right? No, 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 but the car is not okay. faulty. Yes, it is. No, because look, Vegas, a car function in the way it was intended could be used to hit innocent people, ram into a crowd. Right. It, is, it is faulty. 
and the brake system not work, and then I keep putting different driver. No, but you're giving me a fault. different example, Vegas, because you, you try to run away from my point. The dogma is faulty because they took it from a mythical standpoint and turned it into an historical standpoint. That is the brick network. So people are jumping on this train, white and black, not just black people. White and black jumping on this train or jumping in this car, knowing and the brake is not working. It's like the car that is like the defected cars that Ford made. That pe that were, 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 were yeah, they just the throttle just got stuck and they were just ramming into people, cars. I think that was a people. Tesla, wasn't that Tesla? <laughs> Thank you, bro. Yeah, you know, Tesla, Ford I made some cars that people were. They, they, but they, I know they, you get my point as well. I no, know no, you no, get no, my no, point. No, I, I understand what you're trying to say, but what I'm saying is. The devil's advocate cannot work. Listen to me now. The vehicle itself. Let's say the vehicle, because I get what you're trying to say, that the vehicle is faulty, so it's easier to be used to do misdeeds. If the vehicle was better made, aka the doctrine, it would be harder for people to use it for bad things. I get you. All right, all right, all right, all right. Well, let me start to cut you. you, you your analogy about the gun. It's not the gun, it's a person. No, family. I didn't use the gun. I was perfect. I, no. I made sure I didn't use the gun. I no uh, gun. Don't uh, use the gun. Let's go. Use let's a go. knife. Use a knife. Let's you go can knife. use a knife to let's make go. food, let's, or let's you can use knife. a knife to kill someone. Use let's a knife. Go. Let's go knife. Somebody people were using knives and to cut people, right? But now they realize that the knives are not the problem. Because the knives are used to cook food. So people appreciate the knives. The problem with the dogma is it is still being used to kill people and cook food. Wait, I don't, I, you, you lost me. You lost me there. Say it for the slow people. Talk to me like I'm five years old. Talk to me like I'm five. Seriously, go ahead. So the knife was always used to commit some form of crime. Wait, this is an analogy. This is not real life. An analogy. Knives are always used to cut. An analogy. Food. We're food. putting the knife in the in the space of the the, the the dogma. So the knife is basically, um, basically, the object that people use to carry out bad things, right? Or violent crimes or whatever. So they say, um, we're gonna ban knives, right? Someone said, no, 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 no. Just let people, those bad people stop using the knives. They put the knives in the hands of good people that are supposed to take the knives and cook. Only cook to feed you nutrients and things that is good for you. However, the people that they applied or the people that they employed to use the knives to cook food and good food for you, these people are still using the knives to commit some form of crime. Whether them use it to manipulate you and say, hey, boy. So, but, see, is the knife, but is the knife the problem or the people the problem? The facts of the man say, if you didn't get rid of the knife. Then, but how are you going to cook the food? If you, get, if you get rid of the knife, then, get rid of the knife, then, you wouldn't have that problem. Yeah. So then how are you going to cook the food? Because the knives were faulty from morning. So how are you going to cook the food? Find other means. So look, so let's, let's be clear on the parallel for the people that's listening. The food would be social cohesion. How do we create social cohesion where people are, you know, people are able to work together and get things done? Because that's what religion does. It gives us a shared common thing that we can relate to each other from. When you remove that, we resort back to tribalism and shit like that. Or that's what they say will happen. I don't think right. that that's the case, right. but that's what they say. So, I, so you're saying that they have to find a new way for us to co to cohes to be cohesive. The the other well, way they do is called nationalism. Nationalism is the evolution of religion. You know, well, people what, what unite saying, under a flag. But go ahead. What I'm saying is, what I'm saying is, what I'm saying is, if something was created, I thought you were going to sleep. No, no, no. Um, what I'm saying is, if something was created to do some form of evil, like the gunpowder and guns, guns were not created in the first place to do any form of good, you know. 
Well, so, remember, gun so powder was made for celebrations. The Chinese oh, made it to do to do fire. You, know you know what? Once the guns was created, were created, and they start going to places like Africa and those places, you realize eh, them start used to do evil acts. See? All of these things. So guns became problematic. See? And all these things. But guns the are always that created, bad, Vegas. That's why I don't want to use that as an example. Because guns are just bad. Like, There's no good side to Right. Them. Just like the dogma. When them created and turned it, the dogma was fine, you know. Like the gun, the Chinese used to use it for celebration. But now they took it and they started creating wars. You see what I say? So everybody about if they ban guns. Because now guns get into the hands of people who come and shoot up a whole school, shoot up a whole mall, and all of these things. So, so what are you people, saying? Religion can't be in everybody's hands? We're like, what are you trying to say? No, cannot. So who hands should it be in? At this point, the people that the people that had subscribed, that were subscribed, that, that subscribed, the people that who subscribed, excuse me, to the concept of mythicism right those things were um basically allegorical things mythical things or 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 so on or so on so people used to subscribe more to like um zodiacs and all of them things and so it was like harmless it was like a this it was like a discipline that was, was was our principles that were harmless then so whether you believe that the stars are the sun going so on the earth it was more self-governing as opposed to exactly. I got because you. I could wake up. I could wake up and be like, "Oh, I don't have to worship the sun." I could wake up and be like, "F the sun." But the other I'm part where it's like enslaved people do this, do that. That's yes, the part. Exactly, I bro. get it, bro. You think yeah. I'm not listening to you? I'm listening, bro. I got but you. There was no argument that can be made to say some people may have religion as a good thing. That's on you. I can take a prostitute and make her a good thing as well. But when she gets into a zone there, she wanna go back a road. That's on me. Me take up something when me know say, yo, love the streets. So it's just on me. You see me? I say, religion is not good and will not never be good for black people. No matter who take it and try, twist it, turn it, whatever, make it be good, it will never be good for black people. Never, ever, ever. I agree. You see what I'm saying? So that is the issue when we have. And when on independent, I have a problem if you give people, if you want to give Tyler Perry a, a whole day for himself to go pray for TD Jakes and put it on, lay hands on TD Jakes. I have no problem with that, brother. The Gina Jennings in the background. <laughs> I have, listen to me, if you want to bring that, 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 that madman to Jamaica and give him a day, I have no problem with that. You see? Nah, but when you're going to talk about Independence Day, we are already not even independent from the Queen. We don't even have any independence. Still under the crown. And the little that they claim that they gave us, you're still trying now to push this religious idea. Right? Or this, this idea that, okay, we are awarding religious people, so this is the, the, the this is like you're saying and this is so disrespectful to even other people that subscribe to other things right how we not see muta baruka get muta baruka get it let us look at muta, muta baruka out of distinction i think your mic is muted sorry i think muta baruka also might have honorary degrees as well i might be wrong about that but i do think i've seen him get some type of award like like two years ago Yeah, I think what what is what is boom boom Muta Baruka. Muta Baruka went into the stage regular something like 1981 for Muta Baruka and boom boom bam bam bam. Seemed like him, him may get it. And look, I didn't, you know, Muta Baruka went to a technical college too. People think Muta Baruka just didn't go to school. I think, I think he got kind of this thing. But 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 but, but 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 just imagine giving like a, a 
that like Jamaica is not supposed to even be like like a Christ a Christian nation because if they might go up for the same constitution of at bottom under the British rule, so they are they are a Christian nation, I would guess. Unlike they, America. They are the, a constitutional monarchy or some shit. They right, right. They so, they are so basically, yeah. that is what they that they are a Christian nation. So they're just telling us who they really are. That is it. Jamaica is a Christian nation because the 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 the, the, the um the British system, right, is controlled by the church. You think so? Still to this day? I don't think I'm so. Not sure if still to this day. Yeah, in the past, yeah, not now. Though. Right. I, I would have to research that. But the last time I checked, the last, the last source I checked, um, I think they're I think I think they have this, the church somewhat still has some power over the over the over this the, 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 the state. I mean, in the sense that, like, you know, well, there, I, I, I think there's no there. separation. There's no separation between church and state in 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 in, in the British. So system. Vegas, they have power in the sense that the Catholic. A lot of people there are Catholic, and you know, the Catholic have a voting block. If the Pope says something, people are going to lean towards what the Pope says. But you know why I would disagree with it? Because abortion is legal in England, and if they were a Catholic nation. Abortion would not be legal in England. You feel what I'm saying? So, right, but but I don't think there's a separation between church and state in in England. It's a good question. That, that, Look up. No, I, I I'm pretty sure. I just I, I, I listen. I feel stupid not knowing this because I just did it. Yeah, but I think there's no separation. You see what I say? Like like oh the church like here the, the government cannot be you know involved with the. The, estab the establishment and the free the free exercise clause, right? I, I don't think that, bro. I'm sorry, but this is important. It says in English there is a constitutionally established state religion. That's crazy. I had no clue. Thank you, thank you, bro. Thank you. I learned something new today. I had no clue. Thank you. I might have thank to you. read up on that after the live. So, so may I say so? Um, see, 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 Jella, tell you, Anglican, Anglican England. Yeah, so, so you're right. So, in, so England is a Christian state. I'm surprised. Well, I'm surprised that they have abortion. Jamaican, I'm so, surprised they have abortion and that at the same time. That's so crazy. What I'm saying to you is, this is more grounds that I'm standing on to say the order of these things, and it's a joke because the Christian state that colonized us, yes, sir, as a brother, they are still giving out awards to their. To their um their way you call them now their puppets that's not what the word i'm looking for but their servants their confederates are you know them confederates they're just they're, they're just servants yeah who are who are continuing to keep black people in 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 a state of of of, of ignorance under the crown exactly 100 brother so you that got, is the reason why I mean, I was already convinced, but you pushed me over the line even more. I got you. It's a joke. The end of the moral of the argument is, is the that shit is a that distinction is a joke. It's it's, it's a, honorary. It takes the honorary out of honorary to the T. Exactly, brother. So it's nothing for anybody to any black person to be like, yay, oh, all right, that this oh. yeah. And if I, in all honesty, Muta Baruka is a joke. To accept that award, wait, he, wait, you, you, you confirmed that he got one? Yeah. Oh, wow. Sorry, but okay. But I mean, like I said, it's more plex for his wall, so he can talk his shit. I mean, I like oh, Muta Baruka. Like I like okay, him. Muta, I like Muta, Muta should be like Muta should be like because Muta more cognizant of what this is. Yeah, I like him though. He he's good. He's good. But in call out people to do. Yeah, I mean, no man Muta is perfect. Is of, Muta is the king. Of calling out people. Vegas, I love Marcus Garvey. You think Marcus Garvey is perfect? No man is perfect. You know what I'm saying? No, but here we go on. Muta, Muta, studying in them area, brother. He's well studied in this area. Yeah, I respect I don't know if he went and collected the award. Him. You know what? Let me apologize because I don't know if he actually went and be like, yeah, man, give You can probably find a that. video. I'm sure there's a video somewhere. <laughs> I'm gonna go look it up. Give after thanks, the give thanks, give thanks. Yeah, I don't know if you went and did that. But if you go and collect this up, I think listen to me, this is our thing is a joke. Big up myself, brother. Dillinger running. Nobody's saying Dr. Clark and Dr. Ben is perfect. 
Yeah, no, no, we're not expecting nobody to be perfect. Dr. Clark and Dr. Ben, one thing, Dr. Clark and Dr. Ben, they pointed us to the right direction. That is the most important thing. Mood you Baruka, find me a perfect man anyway. Find me Mood one perfect Mood Mood man. owes us a lecture on Selassie. He, he, he's never done a, a show on Selassie? He sure? has never called out Selassie. He subscribed to Selassie. I heard him the other day bigging up Selassie on a program recently. So don't tell me that Muta Baruka must not be called out. They, they cannot even put Muta Baruka in the same sentence with Dr. Ben. Because Dr. Ben and Dr. Clark, they called out everything. They didn't cherry pick. I get it. What? That colonized black people. Even black people. Trust me. You see what I say? So, so Muta Baruka, that basically subscribing to this little Arab man that used to you know, treat the 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 the, the Tigray people and the and 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 the other regions in Africa. You know, didn't I send you that video? Um, his daughter lives here in New York City, and she's just a regular. Well, I wouldn't say regular. She lives in Manhattan, but she's not as as wealthy as you would think. But what's the point is, is this? If you look at her, she does not look black, bro. She looks Arab as hell. But that's today. That's Marshall, one of the he, he, he can't dance. Him, that's a problem I have with Muta Baruka. When Muta Baruka give it to anybody, him talk straight. When him a ridicule or clown anybody, him talk straight. When it, excuse me, when it comes down to calling out Selassie and what even Selassie participated, how Selassie participated in the in the assassination of, of, of Patrice Lumumba, he stay silent. He stay, you see what I say? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, Big mm -hmm. time. Him have, Muta Baruka have all the history and everybody else. Is it? He was listen. King Selassie was about the crown. He was about Queen Elizabeth maintaining the crown. That's what he was about. You Period. know what's funny? Black Paul Paul um, Kagame come, came to Jamaica. The man from Dunga, Rwanda, and he, he's basically, according to reports, he's doing a good. Like he he has moved Rwanda from the bottom of the totem right now. Yeah, yeah, they're, they're the fastest growing economy in the world right to now. One of, to one of the most, to one of the top ten tourist destination in the world. And he's accepting even refugees in this country, African refugees, right? He was, um, he was included in the in the whole tribal war. He wasn't one of the leaders, you know, right? But he came forward and said, you know what? No more war between we, to, to, between we and the, the, the other group. See? And he came to Jamaica, and Jamaican people did not bat an eye. They didn't even look at him. But when Slatsy I was coming to Jamaica, I went Slatsy I came to Jamaica. The Rasta man, the man, everybody broke down the whole highway. I saw the video. I saw the videos, bro. I saw Paul the videos. Kagame is 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 a, is is doing better right now in Africa than what Slatsy ever did in his lifetime. But we'll do another. You know what? All I'm gonna say is this: one thing that pains me so much is they keep on giving King Selassie the credit of abolishing slavery in Ethiopia when that is not the truth. But again, that's all so that Huh? What, what was that? Oh, I said, I, I, I keep on seeing them give King Selassie credit for abolishing slavery in Ethiopia. And that's not true. Rubbish. The Italians abolished slavery Facts. in Ethiopia. Facts. And it came out. And they keep on repeating that lie. It's annoying the fuck out of me. Like, stop back. repeating that lie. It's not true. It's not <laughs> he true. Came, he came back after he ran away like a little rat. Yeah, it's came not back, true. Came back and acted as if he abolished slavery. That shit is not true. You see, you see, uh, uh, this this is women that's why I'm a rate marshal, you know. There are people who are gonna make mistakes, bro. The fact is when you own up to your bullshit, bro. That is the reason why I would I would I would I would give some ratings to Paul Kagami. But also Vegas too. Like I, me personally, when I look at people, I look at the bad and the good, and I weigh it. If the good outweigh the bad, I'm gonna fuck with you. You feel what I'm saying? Uh, now, certain things, obviously, like if you a predator or certain like things like that, right. that's unforgivable. But uh, other qualities that you have, everybody do something to annoy each other. I probably annoy you. I you do shit to annoy me. That's just part of human nature. You feel what I'm saying? Uh, but uh, we weigh the good and the bad. You know what I'm saying? So uh, that's how I view my politicians. I don't expect them to be fucking perfect. 
Facts, bro. But big up yourself, bro. Bro, love all the fucking time, and I appreciate the reasoning, man, as always. I'm going to do some research on your boy, Muta, though. I'm going to send you some links in a little bit. No, Muta, I'm going to skip on Slash. I'm, 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 I'm kind of biased against him, so I don't think I'm the right person to speak on him. <laughs> but we'll chat, though. I appreciate the reason, though. Love all the time, my brother. Cool. All right. Big up on the set, people.